Greetings everyone, this is Potato Hedgehog, and welcome back to Misao Definitive Edition. Last we played... Well... We got corpse partied, that's all I'm gonna say. And Onigawara is a thing now, so let's explore the new grounds of Misao. Everything is different! Everything is weird when it is different! Everything is different! And I like the aesthetics. A fire extinguisher. That's great. Oh, how convenient. Saotome is being attacked by a demon. Yeah! Stay away! Uh, Utome! Toma! Help! Uh, uh, uh. Ah! Man of the year, ladies and gentlemen. I have to save her! I need something to drive it away! How about that fire extinguisher that we found? Even though it's not gonna... It's not gonna help. Sawatome! How dare you do this to Sawatome! Eat this, monster! In the original game, I think she was just in the bathroom when she died. But now she was... How did this crack even happen? There was no way we could have gotten to Sawatome anyway. I'm sorry I couldn't save you. Well, Sawatome is dead. Was that computer always lit up? Security system operational. Deactivation requires a protection disk CD-ROM. Okay. Was this computer always lit up? I love you so much, I love you lots, my heart melts like chocolate when you cross my thoughts. FLASHBACK! OH GOD! Look at this well animated cutscene! Listen up everybody, I got big news! I think you'll agree this one's a riot. What now, Yoshino? Cut the crap and tell us! Well, one of the girls here loves Toma. Huh? Are you confessing to me? You wish it was me! It's none other than the, than the simple girl who never stands out. Misao! Not voicing the classmates because I don't give a fuck. Uh, I... Look, Toma's right over there. Confess your undying love. Sure thing. I'll date you, Misao. Huh? I kinda had a crush on you myself. Then explain Sawatome! Toma... Uh, huh? Toma, are you for real? Misao? Really? You shut your trap. It's none of your business who I'm dating, Yoshino. Let's trade numbers. <laughs> okay... That's Sao Tome, I recognize that hair- that ponytail. Ah! It's still going! Why did Yoshino spill the beans? Well, now like it matters. Because of that, I'm now Toma's girlfriend. I should thank Yoshino. Oh! Toma sent me a text! I like you, Misao. Do you like me too? T toma What? So embarrassing. How should I reply? Look at how Sawatome enters the shot, sticks around for a minute, and then talks to her friend and then fucks off. You had something to do with this, didn't you? What? Look how that guy just exits the shot. Maybe he had something to do with this, too. No. This is... This is all my... 
I just read this. Run away. That has to be embarrassing. This is Yoshino's doing. She must have snuck a look at Toma's phone. She's awful. Yoshino, I know. You like Toma too. You're just jealous. But it'll do you no good. Because Toma likes me. Or so you think. I remember what happens in this game. No! Stop it! The fuck's happening in here? I could never figure out what they were doing in this room, but now with the updated graphics, I can tell what's going on now. And I don't like it. Come on, nobody's around. Toma? Jeez! Toma, you pervert! Aren't you the one who put me south's text on the blackboard, Otome? What? Well, I don't know what you're saying! Who else could have done it? I only showed you, Otome! I didn't do anything! Playing dumb, huh? You have made me so sad. That is something that you do not do. Were those Misao's memories? Yeah, I think they were. So Tome has entered the afterlife. Well, Sao Tome was the first victim. Let's see who else has to die in order for this game to continue. What's this room? ART! I have a feeling that I'm going to die a lot in there, so no thank you. No thank you. I don't like it. Stairs to the roof. I remember this. This is a trap. No matter what version it is, it's a trap. No thank you. Oh, wait a minute. This is the emergency exit puzzle, and I still need a bat in order to open it, so... Yep! Coming off the back of the original Misao, I know the traps of this game. Um, glass broke. Should I be concerned about that? No, I don't think so. VOID! The void into nothingness. I remember this. Okay, I think we're on the second floor now, so a library should be in here. With the swirly eyes and everything. I'll come back to you later. But first, quick save. In case I die or anything. <laughs> that fence, I have a feeling, is a trap. Huh? Someone's in the locker. Open it, fuck it. Hey, you. Teacher! <sighs> Thank goodness. Unbelievable. I passed out after that quake and I came to locked in the locker. It seems it's not. It seems it's designed not to be open from the inside. The school looks odd. I'm going to look around. Sir, it's dangerous here! But he don't give a fuck! I have a feeling that a certain idiot is going to die soon. And for those of you who stuck around for my original playthrough of Misao, like, years ago, you should know who I'm talking about. Remember the, the girl who fawned over him in the beginning? He left. Is he going to be okay? Oh, he's going to be just fine! Give me this. This is a locker key. Mr. Kurata must have dropped it. Locker key. Awesome. Quick save real quick. That is a trap. I gotta remember. That thing is a trap. Ooh. I think we're close to the, la to, to the laboratory. I almost forgot. I hear something! Hide me!
Well, that guy looks awfully familiar! Was that guy even human? Carrying around a chainsaw around a school sure ain't normal. Don't want that guy to come after me or I'd be done for. Um... That laser gate wasn't there before. Got CD-ROM. Let's save real quick. I have a feeling if I cross that, I might die. Oh! Well, I wasn't wrong! <laughs> First death! And I had a feeling that was gonna happen too! God damn it! Okay, how am I gonna get rid of the laser gate? There has to be a way to get rid of this. Oh wait! The CD-ROM I just picked up. Now I remember. Alright, just gotta go back the way I came. Alright, potato, basic knowledge kicking in. Holy shit, everything is different! I love it! I fucking love it! Alright, the computer room is right here. Alright. Use it on the thing. There we go. It's the security system operational. Disable that shit! Security system deactivated. Alright, hopefully that did something to, to, to kill the laser gate. Cause I did not need to see my character bisected. Well... My character in this game, not me myself. <laughs> Alright, let's see if that killed the laser gate. Yep, killed it, but there was something in here. I saw hair coming out of that box, you can't fool me! What's this? Got a plant enrichment. But what do I need that for? HELP! Oh, I forgot, Yoshino is in the lab. DEAD! The goddamn telephone trap! I cannot believe I forgot about that! I am a- I am such an idiot! But good thing I disabled the laser gate before I came back in here. I cannot believe I forgot about the laser trap. I mean the- The telephone. Which paid- Mandrake bombs? I know there's a mandrake in this game, but- Salt mandrakes are made of salt which can be harvested by rubbing them. Mandrake bombs. Mandrake bombs are, st are stuffed with gunpowder. When given a blow, they explode after a few seconds. This explosion is strong enough to destroy even sturdy boulders. Okay, I'll remember that. Danger, do not drink. No! I am not a goddamn idiot. But since some of you get entertainment out of my pain and suffering, fuck it. Glug, glug, glug. Yeah! See? I'm fine. Oh wait. It feels like you're burning from within. Dip. Lovely! Good thing I saved! A test tube sample has escaped. It only just woke from a long sleep, so I imagine it's weakened, but, but, but it's a powerful one. I must find it before any damages occur. Do not walk past the telephone. It'll kill you. Hi, Yoshino. You seem to have lots of fun trying to escape. What's this? Oh, wait a minute. That's one of the places I can go if I want to hide. But no thank you. That's a nice looking bear down there. I might hide in that thing. Hi, Yoshino. Potato! <laughs> Help me! Duh. Just wait. I'll untie you. Whew! Thank you. You're a good guy after all. Way cooler than that kudo jerk. Yoshino... You're always picking on people weaker than you. That's bullying, you know. Uh, huh? What? What about it? Can you promise me something? Promise me you won't bully the weak anymore. 
All right, gee, sure, I will do it. Now help me out here. He's gonna come back if you don't hurry. Who? Let me guess, chainsaw guy. No! I don't want to be a test subject. Don't tell me that's. Damn it! I can't get these off. Both of us are gonna get caught. What can I do? <sighs> gotta stay calm. I know I won't be able to help Yoshino if I get caught too. For now, I gotta find somewhere to hide. Bear! Hide in the bear! Hide in the fucking bear! What is wrong with you? Bear! Hide in the bear! Hide in the bear! Why won't you hide in the- Or hide in the box, fuck it. Ah! Bad idea! Thanks for the jump scare. I really appreciate it. Thanks for the achievement, Steam! Uh, God damn it. I need a knife. Because apparently you can't just hide in that thing like you would normally in the original game. So I need a knife. Where can I find a knife? I cannot rescue Yoshino until I find a knife. Because I need to hide in the bear costume. Oh, good thing I can go back. I think I thought I wasn't able to go back. Do not drink the potion! It's bad! Unless it's a Haruka potion. I see that hair! You can't fool me! Um... Dead body. It's a dead body. Alright, let's just find a knife. Where can we find a knife? Knife, 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 knife. Cutting material. Edge. Infinite. Alright, what's in here? Wait a minute. Ayaka! I thought she would be dead by now. Because I did just break Mr. S Mr. Sosa out of a locker. Ayaka! Good! You're safe! Potato, you're just in time! Now's the chance of a lifetime! Since nobody's around, we're free to look in Mr. Kurata's desk! Damn it, Ayaka! This is no time for that! Look what's happening to the school! Look! Top drawer! Packed with the love letters to Mr. Kurata! Who dares? Who has new dared to send lo love letters to my Mr. Kurata? Let's find out what they wrote. Ayaka! That really couldn't matter less! Let's get somewhere safe! No way! Not until I see it all! I haven't even looked in the bottom drawer! You can pass up the opportunity, but I won't! Don't say I didn't warn you! Yeah, she is gonna die. She's gonna die as soon as I exit this room. Callbacks to the original! Because fuck it! Who? Who sent Mr. Kurata the stupid letter? Hmm? What's this at the end? From teacher's favorite, Ayaka. Oh. Say it with me, everybody! Ayaka, you are a fucking idiot! Call back to my original playthrough, because that's a thing. Chair fell over. Pick it up. No. I still need to find a knife. That third locker is a trap. I remember this. I remember the third locker being a trap. Whoop! It's locked. Wait a minute. Can I get a fucking knife, please? Huh? Obtained cracked cell phone. What do I need a cracked cell phone for? Save. Alright. Why are you still here? I have a feeling that the next time that I come in this room, you're gonna be dead. Go back in. Yep, Ayaka's gone, like I thought. And I believe she ends up in the infirmary because she's running from Mr. Kurata. <coughs> Ayaka! And Mr. Kurata! <coughs> Help! Ayaka? Calm down. The monsters are gone, Ayaka. What happened to Ayaka? 
She's in a panic after being attacked by a monster. You mean being attacked by you, so technically she's right. You were attacked, Ayaka? See, I told you to escape somewhere safe. Hold on. She should stay here and rest. But... Don't worry. I'll be with her. You're basically leaving her with a monster. Don't do it. Alright. I'll leave Ayaka to you, sir. God damn it! I'll keep looking around. Wait a moment. I think I have a tranquilizer on my desk in the faculty room. Could you bring it to me? It may help her calm down a little. Understood. Be careful. Don't you dare die out there. After all, you're one of my dear students. Sir, thank you very much. Don't fall for that shit, goddammit! Because the next time you come in this room, Ayaka is going to be dead. We're well, alright. Where's this motherfucker's desk? Kudata's desk. He tripped you! Strange. I can't find any tranquilizer. He tripped you, you fucking idiot! So, the next time you go to see your best friend, she gonna be dead. Ayaka! Ayaka! You gotta wake up! Ayaka! I'm sorry. I couldn't protect her. A monster appeared out of nowhere. I couldn't do a thing. Damn it! I failed to protect my student. <laughs> Please, sir, don't beat yourself up. It's these evil spirits who are to blame. We gotta do something about them. Wait! You're hurt, too! We have to treat this! <sighs> I'll be fine. Don't worry about me. Just do what needs to be done. Right. Take this. <sighs> I found this while looking around. I suggest not looking inside. She visited me. The day, the day before she went missing. She had something to talk about, but I was so busy, I didn't have the time to listen to her. I know she was pained. I can't help but feel if I had heard her out, she never would have vanished on us. I'm not fit to save her. You're the only one who can. Obtain Mysterious Bundle. I saw hands in there, so... That leads me, leads me to believe that you did it because of what Ayaka told me later this morning. Ayaka is dead. Not big surprise! Alright, I need a knife. I just gotta find a knife. Oh, the scale isn't a trap. For some reason I thought it was. Anything else to say, you bastard? Nope! Rest in peace, Ayaka. Even though it was your own damn fault. Zombie! Okay, she has a knife, but I have a feeling that she's not gonna give it up that easily. Vending machine. Hmm, I'd like some tea, but I don't have any money. Can you give me that knife, please? I would appreciate it. An electric grater. Could probably grate something as big as a radish. Okay, good thing I saved, because I have no idea what was gonna happen. You there! May I please have your knife? Give. Me. The. Knife! Damn you. I'm just not gonna pay attention to the zombie. He seems to be eating a lot, like that one fellow we found in the uh, like, like that one fellow we found in the last part. <laughs> nice, I love it. I love this game. Blood, and we can interact with it, since many of you enjoy my pain and suffering. My neck has been snapped, and I have been decapitated. Lovely. <laughs> Okay, admittedly, that death was kind of funny. Okay. No, apparently we can't do anything in here. I know if you do something in this room, a certain... Wait, what the fuck? Shudder. Yeah! 
Toma! Potato! D don't scare me like that! Toma. So you're always just putting on a bluff, huh? Say what? I couldn't save Sawatomi. She's gone. Oh, Tomi. It, it ain't my fault! I, I didn't do nothing wrong! It's all Misao! Damn it! Misao's gonna kill me too! Help me, Potato! You help me then. We'll save Misao together. Huh? Don't be fooling! It's, me, it's Misao's fault this all happened! Why the hell do you want to save her? Fine. Cower here forever if you want. Don't come crawling to me later. Wait! Wait, wait up! Okay, I'll do whatever! Help with anything! Just don't leave me alone! Got it. Don't fall behind. Yeah! Okay, let's go! Oh, hey, he's actually following me! Unlike the original game. That's cool. Yeah! Toma! 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 Get a hold of yourself! Good. Still breathing. I have to get him treated. What the fuck happened in here? I think we need to take him back to library, even though we don't even know who she is yet. Okay. Sudden cave, un sudden cave under the school. I'm not gonna question it or anything. <laughs> you were in the student council room. Um, uh... Hi, I'm Potato. Uh, Miss Library? No, oh, you remember my name! I'm so glad! <sighs> How many years has it been since I've talked to anyone? Huh? Potato, please be my friend! Uh, already? Oh, you don't want to? If you refuse to be Library's friend, she'll kill you. I've already died enough in this episode, so... Let's be friends! Really? I'm so glad! You're my first friend! This library is kind of awkward, though. I want to know your real name. Well then, Potato, please give me a better name! Yes, I want the most marvelous name! What?! Oh gosh! Oh gosh! What's it gonna be? Well... Um... Please enter her name for library. Um... I don't know! Bookworm! Fuck it! Is Bookworm okay? Yes! It's a wonderful name! From now on, call me Bookworm! Ah, friend. That sounds good. Well, I I've gotta be going. Stuff to do and all. Potato, if you ever have any trouble, please come visit me. I don't know how useful I can be, but I'll do what I can to help. Okay, thanks. Bookworm, I need your assistance. Help Toma, please. I mean, he's my classmate. Why is there a coffin in here? Phew, that should be good. Bookworm, let Toma rest here a while. Seems like the spirits don't seem to come here. Man. He's just a classmate. Toma's not that scary, I swear. So please. Ooh. Well, if you say so, Potato. <clears throat> yeah! it, is this gonna be okay? Look at this! This is the reference! A portrait of a beautiful woman. Reference to Mad Father! Which I... haven't played yet. Derp. Why is there a coffin in here? Why? I don't understand your logic. Bookworm, I need a knife! Hints, please. Three times in the stalls in the girls' bathroom. Gee, thanks. I've been recording for 30 minutes and I don't know what the fuck I'm doing. I still need a knife. 
What is that? What is on the other side of this room? Well, I would be able to find out if that if that wasn't a fucking pit. Quick save. Quick save. I said. Thank you. Anywho, I think this is a good place to stop the episode. So, if you guys enjoyed this episode of Misao Definitive Edition, please leave a like and a comment to let me know, and I will see you guys in the next part. Adios!